Hey guys, Languages Lover here and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be part two of my language book collection, so I got a couple brand new books, so I'm really eager to show you guys my new books, so stay tuned. But first, quick reminder, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell icon to get notified for every new video that I upload, and let's get right into it. So these are just some of the old books. I'm just gonna re-show you the entire collection in this part too, so. These are the little ass mill book I was talking about in one of my previous videos. So here are some of the ass mill books over here as well. We got a Latin dictionary, Latin French dictionary, Polish for dummies. This is a Spanish course with CDs, an English book. This is the book I showed you previously in one of my previous videos. This is the Russian exercise book. I have Fluent Forever, which is a book about language learning. L'Espagnol pour tous. Another book to learn Spanish. This is the... I have two Spanish dictionaries over here. Dean Kunz and Lee Child One Shot. These are two books in English. I also have an Arabic dictionary right here. Vargas Llosa Conversación en la Catedral is a Spanish book I bought in Quebec once. We got Mastering German Vocabulary and Mastering Spanish Vocabulary. Another Spanish book. This is a book that was gifted to me by my... I'm going to show you in better detail right here. Aztecas y Mayas Poemas. This was gifted to me by my Mexican neighbor, so yeah. Over here we have the For Dummies, Dutch, Portuguese, Russian, German, English, Greek, Italian, Arabic, Chinese, Spanish, and Japanese. Going down. This is one of my brand new books right here. Bulgarian. It's just like the Irish book. So I wasn't able to actually get the Croatian B2 level, but I was able to get this one. So this is also part of Asimil. I have the Say It collection right here, which is an old edition. I have, let me see, German, Arabic, Chinese, Dutch, Danish, Swedish, Portuguese, and Italian. Also have the Irish phrase book from Asimil, like last time. Traveling in five languages, which is, let me just do this. French, English, Spanish, Italian, and German. Another Spanish dictionary. This is for Polish. A little Polish book. I have some dictionaries like Portuguese, Italian, Catalan, English, and German. So uh, we also have the Lonely Planet collection. So here they all are. German, Portuguese, Brazilian Portuguese, Hungarian, Ukrainian, Polish, Spanish, Latin American Spanish, Greek, Czech, Croatian, Italian, Dutch, Japanese, Russian, Egyptian Arabic, Bulgarian, Hindi Urdu, Bengali, Thai, Hebrew, Farsi, Moroccan Arabic, Eastern Europe, Western Europe, Mediterranean Europe, Middle East, just remove this so you can just can see the rest. Central Europe, Turkish, Malay, Vietnamese, Mandarin, and Korean. I have Romanian and Danish from ASML. And also three verb books for Spanish, English, and Italian. So now onto the next shelf. All right, so here's the second shelf. We have my Michel Thomas at the top. Start Spanish, start Italian, German, Dutch, Polish, Russian, Arabic, Chinese, Japanese, Hindi for the start. And I have Chinese Vocabulary Builder Spanish Masterclass. Over here is Perfect Russian. And down here we have Total German. Going down. Still from Michelle Thomas, I have both Speak Portuguese and Greek, Advanced and Beginners. I have the Arabic Vocabulary Builder. Well, another Spanish dictionary. I have a lot. So, Ukrainian, Catalan, and Greek from Asimil. 
Over here is a, a book we had in scene, which is for learning Portuguese with different images. So, All right, we have Swedish, ASML, the Japanese kanji book, also from ASML. We have Croatian from ASML. And over here is a bunch of different books you guys haven't seen. I got this one today, which is this is a hundred and one thousand and one phrases to speak Portuguese well. So really good. Let's put it here. By the time I do this, I have a German book about verbs. So yeah, so I have one for Portuguese and one for Spanish. Pretty good. I'll just put them back here and we're gonna move on to the second to last shelf over here. These are a couple of books in Spanish. Jorge Luis Borges. This is a couple of editions I bought at my library. Also have Finnish, Hungarian, Czech, Korean, Turkish, Thai from Asimil. Don Quixote de la Mancha right here which is a book in Spanish, obviously. I also have another book for Spanish, German, and Italian. And last but not least, we have this shelf, which consists of only ASML books. Latin, Dutch, Polish, Hebrew, Persian, Norwegian, and after that we have all my using books, which is using English, using German, using Russian, using Spanish, using Arabic, and we also have using Italian. So this is my entire language learning collection, y'all. So I hope you enjoyed part two. And if you have, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, that'd be super awesome, amazing, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.